Hello and welcome to another update video about Solana. So Solana has been um, doing quite well actually. And um, again, just a quick reminder that we said, okay, down here, when we hit that low, that was really one of the, the coins where we said, okay, we could count a correction complete. So either it is complete or we'll get one more low, but in each scenario, and these are often the best setups, um, we do expect a larger bounce into this area, which is the standard resistance for a fourth wave which would be the short-term bearish count in which we get one more low, which is still not off the table, that's still possible. If we get that one more low, it should ideally hold the 1778 level, not go below that. Otherwise we are morphing into a different higher level scenario or higher degree scenario, not necessarily bearish, but it would mean a much deeper pullback. Um, however, we have it is one of the coins that has produced a possible five wave move to the upside which is fantastic. So we did hold here our small trend reversal area, uh, which I've taken off the chart now because it's not relevant anymore. We did rally in five waves afterwards, not a very clear five wave structure, but acceptable for an ending diagonal. So I'm currently considering if five waves up were complete. For anybody who's not so familiar with Elliott Wave, if five waves up are complete, that means it could be a larger degree wave one which means the trend might have shifted. However, the five waves up is really only the first level of confirmation. We now need the second level of confirmation, which would be that we're holding support um, in an ABC structure. I promised you yesterday, if I see that a top is in place, which could be, it's not 100% confirmed, um, in my opinion, yeah, this could still be, and I wanna make that clear, this could still be um, the fifth wave in the making. Uh, in a much larger ending diagonal. But at the moment, I think due to the sell-off, we can assume that um, a top is in place. Now we can make it simple. We can say that this is support for a possible ABC correction, goes down all the way to 1932. As long as 1932 is holding, the focus can be on higher. So if we get a pullback into this area and reverse out of it, we might be in the third wave because those five waves would be a wave one. If we come down in an ABC correction, we might still be in the wave A. Um, if we find support here and turn around, then this was a wave one top, this was a wave two top, uh, but low, and we would then rally in a third wave to $25 plus. So this is now getting interesting. Um, looking at the micro count, I think we might have completed here within the A wave. Just do that. But this is really just the micro. Yeah, You see a lot of distortions on the micro level. Um, just an idea, okay? So this here could have been the wave one, the wave two, we might still be in the third wave of the A wave, then a fourth and a fifth, just an idea. Um, so the A wave might still be unfolding, um, but more important is to understand that this is where price can go to in a wave two between 1932 and $20. $20 level is going to be important support, I can tell you that. Um, and if we see a reaction here, we could rally in a third wave. If we don't even get there, then chances are, that we haven't even completed wave five. But that's why I say against 1932, we can focus on higher. So as long as we don't break below that level, the focus is higher. Um, you can also add a trend line, which might help you because the trend line is currently, I think being a tier two more or less. So if that breaks, it would be a, let's say more or less a strong confirmation that we are in this, um, in this ABC correction, which could be a wave two. So I'm watching for that. Um, it's it's very interesting um, chart. Uh, I think the Elliott waves were very accurate on this one, also on the micro level, which isn't always the case. So I think this is the level to watch out for. Of course, if we break above the 2140 level, which is the Tuesday high, it indicates the fifth wave is still in the making. Yeah. Okay, that's my update about Solana. I hope you will like the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.